I'm going to share with you my favorite counterfeit coin of all times. I just bought this coin in a collection. I really love this coin. I'm not joking. Over here in our Coin Help You community, this tested out at 94.1% silver, this Kennedy half dollar, and it's supposed to be 90%. Come over here to uh, Coin Help You community and see if you can help out with this one. See what's going on. We have world coins on our website. Also check out our auctions and our 5% off all silver dollars, including the silver eagles. So here it is. This is my favorite counterfeit coin. This is a 1756 Zurich City View. And you can see the pimples and the repair up here. And I'm going to get a little bit closer. I love City View coins. I never bought them. I didn't have them come in the shop. This came in a collection. You can see the date down here, but as you can look closer and closer, you can see the pimples all over this coin. And even though it's it's still beautiful, I like this coin. I wish that it wasn't, you know, had a problem like that. The pimples all over it and the counterfeit. It's it's possibly cast. I can't be a hundred percent sure. There is the edge on this. It's a half thaler, thaler, however you pronounce it. But I just, I really do like this coin and I try to find information on it. Wait, I try to test it. it it'll get a bar on pre 45, 90% US coins, but it doesn't get anything on the rest of the silver setting. So I can't really test it. So over here on Numista, it has the half dollar listed. It has the weight at 13.13 13 grams and the diameter is 32 millimeter. And I can weigh it in the grams, and it weighs 14.1. So it weighs over a, a little more than what I, I'm comfortable with. So I'm comfortable with calling it a counterfeit coin. If it wasn't a counterfeit coin and looking at it not repaired, you know, it could be worth a few hundred dollars. Now, as repaired, a hundred bucks or less if it was authentic. Um, you know, I really hate that. I, I do like this coin. And, it's made me want to buy one, honestly. It's just so unfortunate that this coin is not authentic. I mean, it was in a holder. You know, you're buying a bunch of coins. We bought the, we bought this huge world coin collection. As I said, we've been putting world coins up on the site. I mean, it ran the gamut of everything. It had hundreds of coins in it. But boy, I'll tell you what. For a counterfeit, it's a nice coin. And if you got a counterfeit one, I guess this, <laughs> this is the one you counterfeit, right? I, I don't know. But anyway... Some other things that's interesting about this, I've always been interested in old architecture and old sites and the old world and, and visiting places like this. I would love to go to Zurich myself. You know, this view, this city view still exists. It's a little different uh, than on the it, it was back then. But here is uh, one of the pictures. I was trying to find one that might be close to the actual angle as the coin but I didn't see one, but you can see it here. It's it's just beautiful. It would be just to walk along through here, eat at a, a, one of the cafes or something like that would be really cool. Here's the, it shows the churches here. I can actually click on that, clear. This is from the other angle, whereas the coin view is coming towards us. But yet you can still see the churches are still there, the steeples. You know, some of the bridges and things like that. Not everything's there. It's not all exactly the same. Because this was back in 1756 or 1700s. But here's another image of it. I tried to find an image with pimples on it. Just to, I wanted to hope that it's not, you know, fake. But here's another larger view of it that's over here on PCGS's website. They've got silver. They don't have weights or anything on it either. They're just older coins and there wasn't mint specifications that were so exact back then. But anyways, I wanted to share that with everyone. We take one last look at my favorite counterfeit coin. <laughs> and, you know, I like I said, I would like to visit Zurich or any of these uh, towns. But, yeah, this is um, a really nice coin. Maybe I'll just look for one and, and buy one. Or Christmas guys coming up here. Of course, it won't get here before Christmas. Anybody got one out there they want to send me? <laughs> So thanks for watching my latest video. And like I said, if it's counterfeit, uh, you think it is, or you want to check your coins, just weigh them, check out diameters, uh, do a little research on them. 
Uh, if the surfaces have irregularities or die marks they shouldn't or pimples, that's going to help you out. Uh, you can't really paint it. I mean, there's just no apps for this. There's just a coin that you have to know a little bit more about. It's a little more advanced of a counterfeit detection. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and share this video and have a great day.